soulmates, buddies, best friends, your better half. No matter what you call them, you just aren't you without them. Like coffee is not coffee without coffee man. They belong together. The way they curl up in a mug and create that smooth flavor, that velvety texture, a certain something that's so much more than just a cup of coffee. Coffee made from Nestle. Coffee's perfect made. Victoria's Secret's annual bra sale is on now. For eight days only, save 25 to 50% on our best bras. Hurry to Victoria's Secret for 25 to 50% off our best bras now at the annual bra sale. Only at Victoria's Secret. New Year's Eve. You look radiant tonight. A place where dreams were made. Is everyone having a good time? And hopes were shattered. <laughs> Oscar nominee Gloria Stewart relives a sweeping story of romance, forbidden love, and murder. A special General Hospital on New Year's Eve. Stay tuned for scenes from the next General Hospital. When you're a baby, your sense of touch is more intense. So things can feel different to you. That's why Pampers created new sensitive touch wipes. They're made from a new cloth-like material that's softer than the other leading wipes. It's a difference you can feel. New sensitive touch wipes. Inspired by babies. Created by Pampers. No time to do your hair? Style it on the go with cordless Thermacell. Hair gone limp? Touch it up with cordless Thermacell. Your workout too intense? Get your look back in shape with cordless Thermacell. Style, curl, or straighten your hair anywhere. Just push in the energy cell and it heats up fast. Look terrific wherever you go. Its compact case fits right in your purse. And now it comes in these four cool colors. Cordless Thermacell. Available at Kmart, Walgreens, Eckerd, and CVS. Makes a great gift. Mornings haven't changed much. Cream of wheat has. It's instant. Now with two new flavors, strawberries and cream with real strawberries and peaches and cream with real peaches. Both with eight essential vitamins and minerals. Cream of wheat. It just might be the most comforting part of the morning. Shocked, absolutely shocked. Every year, Publishers Clearinghouse surprises winners all over these United States. Now, you could be next. February 14th, the Prize Patrol could surprise you with $10 million. On live TV. Will it be you? I dream or what? What will you say? Holy shit. Watch your mail or go to pch.com. Enter, and on Valentine's Day, our next $10 million winner could be you. Heartburn slowing you down. Try extra strength Mylanta. Cooling relief that speeds right to where you need it. Nothing's faster. Extra strength Mylanta. Soothing at the speed of life. What do you get when you mix a chef, a plumber, and a policeman with an abandoned restaurant? A recipe for success. Donating time and materials, they turned that old restaurant into a family center. Now they're all building a better community, volunteering to help keep kids away from drugs. So visit HelpYourCommunity.org to see what your group can do. Because you get more... When you get together! On the next General Hospital. New Year's Eve, 1926. Is everyone having a good time? We were young, immortal. What could possibly go wrong? That New Year's Eve was opening night and closing night. The Roaring Twenties come alive again on a special New Year's Eve episode of General Hospital, tomorrow. Paul Callan never believed in miracles, but everything... There's something really weird happening here. ...is about to change. Now this I've never seen. Ignore your fears. Help us. Open your eyes. Trust your heart. I'll be right here. Miracles, Monday, January 27th on ABC. Viewer discretion advised.
The head of CloneAid, the group which claims to have produced the first human clone, says the newborn baby named Eve will arrive home in the U.S. sometime today. Bridget Boisselier says the child will undergo DNA tests. And the Dow up about 28 points right here, and the Nasdaq off about 8 points. Joe Kernan, Bob Pisani, and Leslie LaRoche all join me to take you to the close. Leslie, we haven't heard from you in a while. What's happening there at the Nasdaq right now? It's a very slow day, not surprising, uh, Maria, but the Nasdaq has underperformed the Dow throughout the session. We had selling pressure in semiconductors, in hardware, and in uh, even in biotech to some extent. Although we did have a bid under some of the retailers and the internet stocks. Amazon came back by about 2% after getting slammed for 15% losses last week. But Maria, these geopolitical concerns are not to be underestimated. Iraq, of, of the two between Iraq and North Korea, in some ways, Iraq is the known quantity, and North Korea is the greater wild card in this, in this equation. So folks are, are just kind of hanging back waiting for the new year, waiting for some clarification. For sure. And Bapasani, possibly given the fact that the end of the year was not a great one for the major averages, possibly the North Korea situation dampened expectations. Yeah, nothing worked this year. Not the Santa Claus rally, at least not yet. How about the January effect, Maria? That's the next thing that may not work. That's how cynical traders have become here right now, Maria. And there's the closing bell. Big smiles there at the podium as Carol Flynn brings down the gavel for the last time at the New York Stock Exchange. That's a retiring member with some of her colleagues, as you see there. She's all smiles on a day that volume was on the light side today. The Dow, though, on the upside by 26 points. NASDAQ was under pressure, down about eight and three quarters points at four o'clock on the East Coast. There is a picture of the exterior shot of the NASDAQ in Times Square. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Maria Bartiromo. My partner, Tyler. Courtroom of Judge Judith Scheinlin. The people are real. The cases are real. The rulings are final. This is her courtroom. This is Judge Judy.